Okay, so today we're gonna, oh my goodness, I got so excited about hitting stuff. Peace and love, strength and honor, Samir Seif representing Ontario Top Team. And today, continuing in the weapon series, now we're gonna try and hit some stuff. So we're gonna go back to the first video so that you can see what it was that I was talking about, about coordination, and if you notice where I'm hitting, and this is that edge awareness where I showed you forehand, backhand, backhand, forehand, backhand, backhand, and then I started uh, using my hip, right? Boom! And then you start to see more power, right? So it's forehand, backhand, backhand, forehand, backhand, backhand, forehand, backhand, backhand. Whoa! Nothing like that, my friends. Yeah, then, uh, then I showed you the, the um, Heaven Six, where you're more like this. So again, you can start out here, and then as you get a good vibe for the angles, a little bit of the angles, nothing too crazy, nothing too crazy about your hip. I just like getting you comfortable. I start to get close and in chamber and whack. And that's the heaven six. And then I showed you the uh, single baton of the angles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. And you get the angles. So it's just a practice of whether I am cutting through, where I'm slashing, turning my hips, or whether I'm with ticking or whacking them with a spring energy or a puño. But this is a good start. Find something that you can use, preferably not your best friend, and just start with the first one. Forehand, backhand, backhand, forehand, backhand, backhand. Once you have good surface time and good, good retraction, then you just go a little bit more closer and start to chamber. And you'll see the chambering is gonna help control the distance. That's it, my friends. Peace and love. Strength and honor, Samir Saif, representing Ontario Top Team. Pow!